Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, I hope you had great festivities with New Year's Eve and Christmas and everything. Hope those were awesome for you. And all right, let's talk about the video. The last time I've talked about the things I don't like about my uh, F800 GS Adventure. So this time it's time for uh, what I actually love about the bike because the bike's awesome and it deserves a video. Okay, so the first thing I actually love about the bike, the first thing is the looks. Uh, she has that particular, you know, BMW styling and she also resembles a huge dirt bike, uh, which, you know, she actually is. She is a massive dirt bike, not as massive as the 1200, but still a pretty big one. Now, the second thing I love about the GSA are the ergonomics, or rather the triangulation between handlebar, foot pegs, and seat. It's very comfortable for touring, and it's also very good for off-road, although in honesty, I think I need to buy uh, a couple risers for when, when I ride standing up. But overall, I, I really like the uh, the ergonomics of the bike. Now, the third thing I love about the GSA is the 800 para parallel twin. Sorry, guys, it's a bit of a tongue twister. It's a nice engine. It has a decent amount of torque. Uh, it only has 85 hor horsepower, but for touring and for uh, light off-road, there's more than, in, more than enough, so it's okay. The fourth thing I like about the GSA is the tank, but only the GSA's tank, as it's bigger than the standard GS800's tank, and it holds a 24 liter of fuel. Also, I like the position of the tank since it's in the back and it lowers the overall center of gravity of the bike, making it easier to maneuver in tight spaces or off-road. It's just good. And being bigger, holding 24 liters, it gives me a fuel range of actually, uh, I'd say, 400 to 450 kilometers, which is more than enough. Lastly, the fifth thing I love about the GSA, and I know some people will disagree with me, but it's the uh, overall finishing. Uh, I heard a lot of people complaining that the plastics are flimsy and, you know, not uh, properly paired together, but I don't know. I think it's, you know, mm, how can I say it? Overall, BMW uh, made this bike with a lot of quality and uh, thought while creating it. So I, I like that. Also, the, the plastics aren't really, you know, that poorly matched. Look at that. There's not even a, a single uh, space in between them. So, no, but really, I... I I really love how it's built. So yeah, guys, those were my, the five things I love about the F800 GS Adventure. Uh, it's a, a nice, in quotes, little bike. Uh, it does everything I need to do. It's actually cheaper than the 1200 to both own and uh, maintain. Fuel consumption, as I said, it's almost non-existent. I have an average of uh, 25 to 28 kilometers per liter of fuel. And I can hold, I mean, the bike can hold 24 liters, so that's quite a lot. The engine is honest. I like the, the gears, the gears, the spacing, the, the actual mechanism, it's precise. I love the brakes, they are honest, uh, 
And overall, I like the concept of this bike. As I said, it's a big off-road dual sport adventure bike. And it's also a comfortable bike for touring. So, you know, it's not as specialized as an enduro bike. And for the same reason, not as specialized as a touring bike, like a, I don't know, a BMW RT, let's say. But it allows the rider me in this case to do whatever I want which is both touring and going off-road so more power to me I guess uh, anyway thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed this mini series composed of both what I love and what I hate about the GSA and as usual any comment is welcome what are the things you guys actually love about the F800 GSA or the uh, stock GSA, the 650, the 700, you name it, we, they are all bikes from the same, you know, family. So lots of things are shared. So it's up to you guys. What are your, your thoughts? What you, what you like about uh, this family of bikes? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to put a little like if you please, if you enjoyed the video. And if you really enjoyed it, think about subscribing. Thanks for watching and see you next time, guys. Hope you have a great one. Ride safe.